blueprint, so I got my three axes here, all made by Sager. This is the Sager, nice narrow, definitely a fallen profile. Heard these referred to as a swamper. You can see I have it on. I think this must be a. Man, what is it? 30, 32 inch, I think. And this is a 28 inch handle. Another 32 single bit Sager. Now, if you look here, the single bits have similar profile or the single the the single and the double here the double is actually just a slight bit thicker this is a very slim profile on a single bit almost more for falling for chopping not splitting swamper and this one's a bit thicker this is a, a much better all-around type splitter these ones with a thinner profile will work in really dense grain stuff pretty well. But uh, I got three similar blocks behind me and we'll do one with some jacks. So let's start with this shorter handled little swamper. Well, that popped it apart like nothing. Now we'll go to the single bit. Now that did okay. We had to kind of pop it off from the side. But that's kind of part of the technique. With the thinner profile is don't hit it dead center. Kind of slice pieces off the side if you need to. So here's like the like the stereotypical Puget pattern. So there's that. Now we'll go with these butt cuts, which you can kind of see they're oval. And we'll use the same three axes so if you go lengthwise here they can be hard to split sometimes the narrow side works best I'll try that if not I'll start chipping them off the side so that went through pretty good Had a little flick on that one. These ones you can uh, really flick them pretty easy. So that split this piece real well. We'll try and do the same thing with the single bit. Almost took the camera stand up. So, here's a shorter swamper. Usually, a, you know, your better all around one. Now that went through, but. was closer to not so so that's those three different styles and change the angle and probably just start going at the pile with this one
now. For burning, I like to leave some of these smaller ones whole, poke them right in the stove. That'll burn all night long. Very nice to have. Now you don't want to get too many of them mixed in. Won't start a fire worth a darn, but good piece to put up just before you head to bed. Now, this one. Just when you're blasting through, nice little knot right there. All we need to do is bust this in half, so we'll just go 90 degrees to the knot. And normally I just kind of go nuts through the pile, but uh, I have a power cord running right in there, so I have to start pulling the stuff out. Okay, so that was just kind of a quick, through that, we got about, you know, on camera there, probably half that wood that, you know, I guess two previous videos were up in the woods, cutting it real quick, buzzing it into rounds here, now we're splitting it, you know, so, you can bust through that pretty quick, granted it's easy splitting, you know, I'm sure everyone that splits oak wishes it would split that way, but this is what we got, this is what we burn, you know, and there's not much here. I wanted to play with these old axes. You know, I got the log splitter I'll get out to push a volume through. In short order, hand splitting is faster. The longer and longer you do it, the log splitter catches up. Just fatigue, you know, but after being laid up for a while, uh, definitely doesn't hurt to get the heart beating a little bit, you know, but. We, I don't know, it's a back away for this camera. But that snow level right above us, we got the Cascade Range right behind us here. So it's a nice, cool day. So I'm recording this on Monday, the uh, 16th. And then Thursday, the 19th, there's a bid opening that I uh, got a bid in on the uh it's just a 10 quarter so 
hopefully I'll get it. You know, I'm not going to bid something crazy high uh, on it. So we'll see if I get it. I, I threw a bid in on this one of, I think it was 55 a quarter or something. Yeah, I believe so. So the way that works is it was like 55.30 a quarter I threw in on it. So you pay that times 10, $553. Plus they charge you two dollars per cord uh, road maintenance fee, so another twenty, so five uh, seventy three total for the ten. And mostly I just want to get in on one, see if I can beat the the one guy out. I know, looking he's been bidding fifty one twenty five, so yeah, you know, it's more than I'd like to pay for it, but throw one in there trying to at least win one but uh and we'll see a lot of my other means since i were laid up if you know i gotta work back into all those but anyhow that was my quick little video there and you guys have a good one and remember keep your tip out of the dirt